Good morning, crafties. Today is Saturday, March the 16th, and I'm at Doggy Days in Clear Lake Campground. Today, we're going to go have a potluck breakfast to start with, and then the young lady who spoke last night is going to lead us in a nose training course for the dogs. So that should be a lot of fun. Stay tuned for more. This is the beginnings of our breakfast potluck. It's in here. Ooh, yummy. One of the ladies just brought this fatata over. Doesn't that look delicious? What's your ki what's your kitty's name? Blue. Blue. Blue is the kitty's name. We have a cat in the group, and Ruby's not too sure about the cat. <laughs> well, Bridget's is looking at the kitty and doing very well. Linnell says she's never met a cat. Oh, look at <laughs> Very good. We're in the doggy park, and the doggies are running. This is Annie. This is Brittany. Which, oh, Brittany, I'm sorry. That's okay. And your name? I'm Sue. Sue. Sue Ingalls. Right. We've got uh, Stormy and Mark over there, and they're Rita's babies. <laughs> and they're having a good time. <laughs> this is Sue and her beautiful Cocker Spaniels. Orville and Wilbur, and their last name used to be Wright, because they belong to a lady with the last name of Wright. And there's, there's Stacy and Annie. Orville, tennis ball. Where's your tennis ball, Orville? Where is it? Where is it? Where's a tennis ball? Where is it? Can I leave it? There's Michelle, and she's got two rat terriers, Roscoe and Rowdy. We got a lot of dogs in this little dog park and they're all getting along just fine. Yes. It's good for anxiety. So, um, and everybody has anxiety. We live in an anxiety society. This is um, introduction to nose work. Um, I, somebody asked me, they said, I want my dog to learn how to find my phone. You can take a little piece of essential oil, a certain type of essential oil, and put a little tab on your phone, oh, yeah, and right. your dog can 
learn how to find your phone, your keys, your remote, your sunglasses, things that you lose on a regular basis. Annie and Susan. Smiles. It's called a submissive smile. She's not ready to fight. Okay. Okay, you're gonna wait right here. So Val is putting a treat in the box, and now Susan is going up with Annie. You're gonna say find it or search. What's your word? She's gonna say find it, search, or some other word, so she can find the the treat. This is the first time for all of these dogs to do this. So. Val's going up to hide another treat. This time, Woody is going to be up there. He's a little Karen Terrier. <laughs> Good boy, found it. So Wilbur and Orville are going to be going up there in just a minute. Orville's going up. Okay, she's going to go hide the treat in the box. This is Orville, right? Orville. Orville's going to go up and find his treat. Found it! Stacy and Annie are going up next. How many? <laughs> she found it right away. Good girl, Annie. Hey. Dee Dee and Kai are going next. This is the easy part. The boxes are open and the dogs can find the treat easily. And then we're going to do it again. It's going to get a little harder. She's probably going to close the box. This is Dee Dee and Kai. taking a little longer. There he did it. Now it's my turn with Snickers. Stacy is taking my video, so let's see what happens. What's your name? Sarah. Sarah and Buddy are going to go up next. Wow, that was fast. Okay, there's Ruby. Ha, ha, ha. 
<laughs> Ruby's having a little difficulty finding her treat. There she found it. Okay, Wilbur's going up. Wilbur's sniffing. He's going to walk right over to it. Good boy, Wilbur. Found it. On the other platform, Dominica is leading the rest of the group. There's nine people and dogs in each group. Well, actually, in our group, there were ten dogs because you had Wilbur and Orville together. And so here are the ladies over there, some in mine, some in the other group. And we're going to be doing that, the exercise a second time, but more boxes are going to be added. There goes Sue and Annie again. This is the second time for them. And there are a lot more boxes up there. A lot more boxes up there. They are all still open. Ah, found it right away. Good girl, Annie. Springer. Yay, she found it. And a little uh, Karen Terrier is going up. And now she's going up. He's going up. This is his second trial. There you go. Good boy. Now Patty and her beautiful lab are going up. Patty trains uh, dogs for the blind and she's kept this dog because she has some hip dysplasia. either. Here comes Buddy again for his second trial. Stacy and Annie are going again. There it is. Good girl, Annie. Okay, it's Snickers and me. 
Thanks to Dee Dee, she's got my phone and doing the video. And Ruby and Michelle are up now. I don't even think she knew. Yeah, good girl, Ruby. There's uh, more people over on the other side doing theirs. Okay. Margie's going with Teeny. Yeah, good girl, Teeny. Up there now. Good girl. There, he found it. Good girl. Good boy, Wilbur. talking about essential oils that some essential oils are toxic to dogs so if you're going to scent, do scent training you put a little essential oil that is okay in a q-tip in a bottle and then put a treat in it and then gradually take away the treat so they can discover the oil to shorten the video a bit I'm going to show you round four where the boxes are closed So this time, Val is changing the location the treat and will be in, and also will be closing the boxes. This is trial four. Annie and Sue are going again. I'm going to make these videos a little shorter because I'm running out of battery. She went right to it. She's got a good nose. She knows what she's doing. comes Nancy and her Springer. Now the boxes are closed. She found it. He found it. Good dog. Okay, we got uh, we got Woody again. Ah, he was watching. He was watching, but that's okay. Next up is Patty and Bella. Fourth trial. Boxes are closed. There she found it. All right, Bella. All right. All right, we got Orville back up. Oh, there it is. He found it. We got Annie and Stacy up again. Yep, she found it. Good girl, Annie. Dee Dee and Kai are going up. There, he found it. Good boy, Kai. We got Buddy, 
Oh, we got four more. Okay, there's Buddy. It's going up again. Okay, Buddy's going up. There it is. He found it. Go open the box, Mom. And it's Snickers fourth time. Where's the tree? Where is it? Find the tree. Where's the tree? Where is it? Come here. Where's the tree? Find the tree, Snickers. Snickers. Oh, good. Okay, Margie and Tiny are going up. Teeny Tiny. Find it by herself. Teeny's going to find it. There, she found it. We're having a potluck this evening for dinner. And uh, it's supposed to be appetizers, but there's a lot more here than appetizers. There's some pinwheels. I brought the veggie tray. There's quesadillas over there. Cheese and crackers. And pickled sandwich and hot dogs and all kinds of yummy things. Tell me your name again. And Dion. Don and Dion. Okay. And you specialize in Irish folk music? Well, I wish um, old time fiddle music and, and uh, I just American American some pop, you know, these are a little bit of Good. Okay. All right. Thank you for playing. Continue. <laughs> Wow, what a feast we had. Most of those were all hors d'oeuvres, but we all made a meal of it. The sun is going down on another doggy days. We had a fantastic time. All the dogs were so good. I want to thank Val for all her training with us, the scent training and the, and the demonstrations she did. I want to thank Dominica for all the planning she does with these girl camper events. And all the ladies that were here are just fantastic. I have met many of them before, but I met some new people, and I think we're going to be friends for life. So, if you liked the video, give me a thumbs up. Comment, share, and subscribe. Smash that bell. Share and subscribe. Thanks for watching, and stay crafty when going to Doggy Days. Thanks for watching. Tomorrow, Sunday, people will be leaving, so I'll try and get a little video of them exiting the park. 
stay tuned for Doggy Days 2 Part 3 in the next video when we celebrate St. Patrick's Day. Thanks for watching.